um, I have a cookbook, and I'm going to be, excuse me, sorry, to be reading a, a few quotes to you today. Um, they're, they're my favorite long quotes, so, I got them off Tumblr and stuff, so, okay. Here's number 52. Have you ever broke down sobbing after so long of being strong? Crumble to the floor, hands by your face, your face scratches up, and you let out that first gasp. You try to be quiet. But eventually, it becomes loud, heart-wrenching sobs. You cry and cry. So much, you can't breathe. You ask whoever's up there, why? Why me? Why, can't, why this? Why can't I just be dead? You say you want to end it all right there, right then. You sob, trying to gasp breaths in between. Eventually, you completely collapse on the floor after, and you just lay there, numb. Because the next one is number 53. Now, this one is about society. Society says everyone is beautiful. Society says don't eat, though. You don't want to get fat. Society says you don't eat. Anorexic freak. Society says you're a size 4. You're supposed to be a size 0. Society says you're an A cup. What? Are you 8? Society says you're a C cup. That's my mom's size. Society says, you had sex? Slut? Society says, you haven't had sex? Ha, you're frigid. Society says, you don't think you're pretty? Attention seeker. Society says, you think you're pretty? Conceited much? Society says, you believe in gay rights? Homo. Society says, you don't believe in gay rights? Homophobic dickhead. Society says, you're depressed, attention seeker. Society says, you cut yourself, still attention seeking. Society says, you can't go on, how much attention do you want? So, so then someone kills themselves, right? Society says, oh, they were so beautiful. Society sucks. I love that quote. The next one is number 81. What is heartbreak? Heartbreak is laying on the bathroom floor, trying your damn hardest to breathe, while at the same time wondering why, why, why it all went wrong, and how you're going to get up and pretend like everything is alright, and what the hell are you going to do about that hole in your chest? Yeah, that's heartbreak. The next one is number 84. I hate when people joke about cutting suicide or eating disorders. The thing is, you have no idea what people go through. You can't be sta you could be standing right next to someone who's planning on ending their own life and you may never know it. Please stop. It really, really hurts. Okay, and then the next one is one twelve. Wait, last page. Trust me. Trust me. I don't have feels. I know how it hurts. I know how you cry in the shower so no one will hear your screams. I know how you wait until everyone goes to sleep to f just fall apart. It's not always easy, but I know exactly what that feels like. And then the last one is number 214. That I'm going to show you guys today. At some point, you're going to sit in your bed all night and cry about everything that's happened to you that day. You're going to have a day where everything goes perfect. Nothing is ever going to go as planned. You're going to have a best friend that find out they talk shit about you behind your back. You're going to meet the most amazing person in the world, fall in love, and then get left behind and forgotten about a month later. You're going to go on a vacation and miss everything about it when you believe. You're going to have the best day of your life. You're going to have moments where you feel like nothing could bring you down and invention and everything is just perfect. You're going to go to parties and get taken advantage of. You're going to get drunk and say something you regret saying. You're going to have someone you share everything with. Then slowly fade away from each other and eventually never talk again. You're going to take pictures and think, what was I thinking a year later? You're going to go on the most amazing trip. I mean, the most amazing people ever and then never talk or see them again. You're going to fall in and out of love. You're going to tell someone something and it's going to spread around. You're going to read something that breaks your heart. But you can't stop 
reading it. But you just can't stop reading it over and over. You're going to miss someone every day, but not do anything about it. You're going to have awkward moments where you see someone and remember everything that you've been through together. You're going to be a bitch to someone, but not realize how much it affected them. You're going to have to act like you don't care when really, you're heartbroken. You're going to kiss people and regret it later. You're going to miss a lot. Don't slow down. Have don't have regrets. Don't live in the past. Don't live in the future. Don't. Just live for right now. Smile. You're young and you're only getting older. Don't let anyone stop you. Um, I, I, have a lot of, I have a lot of quotes in this whole book, but I am still going. So, adios. <laughs>